So you're telling me I'm in a town I can't leave? Get these people home, Sheriff. Do everything I can. We're gonna fix this. Dad, you're not seeing what's happening here. I feel like I'm hanging on by a thread. What are we gonna do? People are scared. You need to be the one to tell them it's gonna be okay. There you are. Hi, Jeb. What's going on, Harold? It's been about two months. I'm so excited to talk to you again. Season finale of From. I'm a huge fan. And I'm just good, good. From two months ago, now you're oh yeah. Game. I've seen all I've seen all 10 actually. But I'm just trying to say ah. this, this is to recap the series, you know. So if, if people haven't seen it, I'm talking to you about some episodes, you know. So if you haven't seen the show, this isn't the interview to watch yet because I've got some questions for you, my friend. Uh, and Let's just go. in case, just in case, I didn't know, don't worry about during the interview. I got the talisman right here. So these night walkers aren't going to mess with us. And if you need a snack during the interview, I got my lunchbox too. All right. So, got it. All right. <laughs> but what I'm really wondering is if that talisman works virtually. Like you have it there. Does it protect me here? I, I, it's, a, it's a pretty existential question, but I'm wondering. We'll You're freaking out. me out here, but I'm, I'm holding on to it during the interview. I'll tell you that. <laughs> Well, you know, how has Sheriff Stevens protected the townspeople this season? Are, is, are you happy with his uh, his job or is there a lot room for improvement? Look, I, I think he's done the best that he could. I think he, he's had some hard choices to make. Uh, you know, some of those things that, you know, he thought would be easier. He thought he could scare some folks into doing the right thing. Clearly, some people need more than that. Uh, uh, um, but uh, I think he's done all, all the right things and I think he's doing the right thing right now by trying to uh, deal with the ticking clock, which is his body uh, and, and and doing what he can to get these folks. I, I think no one can blame him for not trying. I think he's dedicated, I'll tell you that, but I think he's frustrated because he, he can't understand his surroundings and he can't save these people. Right, it, it, it's, it's, it's a frust frustrating thing about people. You think, oh, this makes sense, then everyone will. But that's just not how the world works. <laughs> you know and, and his strained relationship with his son, Ellis, you know, all has been revealed. You know, he couldn't understand what was going on and not, and you could understand why Ellis didn't want anything to do with his father. Y yeah, you could understand it. And, and, and you could also understand the choice that his dad made. Like, it's one of those, like, there's uh, this 10 seconds, this two seconds, not even yeah. 10, and you got to make a choice. And you just have to make a choice and you don't know. And it's, it's terrible, and I would never want that to happen to anyone. I remember oh, the, reading it going, like, oh my gosh, this is, oh. Yeah, especially, I, and Sheriff, you know, Boyd has to go through the death of his wife. That gravesite scene, I, I, that was, I think, for you, the highlight of the series. I mean, that was just one emotional oh. moment, wasn't it? Thank, yeah, yeah, it really, really was. I think that, that's, that was one of those things, because he's just asking, you know, like, after having to have done that, he still has to try to maintain some kind of, he still loves her so much. That's just it. It's no, no, no out of that. He's still so, grieving. Yeah, he's still grieving. He's still grieving. And then he has to, you know, deal with his son while he's grieving and just like, look, just be as honest as he can with his son. And because he loves him as well. And it's just, and it's a grief he can't even share with his son. It's too hard. And, and I'm telling you, Harold, Colony House got ravaged. People let their guard down. You know, I, part of me was like, you deserve it because you're partying, you know? <laughs> you know, but Elizabeth Saunders, who plays Donna, what a turn Woo! of force, isn't she? Woo! Isn't she great on the show? <laughs> yes. She's, I, uh, the show, and some of those things I wasn't there for, and like, I watched them, and then right away got on, like, on my text, like, Elizabeth Saunders, you genius, you! Like, just right away. She's so good. So I would follow good. her. I would follow her, too. You know, she is just... Exactly. I mean, she, Wherever she's going, I'm going to be right behind because she's yeah. going to protect you. <laughs> and, you know, Sarah communicating with something, you know, and Boyd doesn't trust her. And we're, we're finding out in the finale, they're trying to find a way out, a last-ditch effort to save these people. Uh, but that trust that Boyd has with Sarah, it's just not there, is it? Nah, it's not. Like, he's trying, but, like, you know... She killed a lot of people. <laughs> lot I wouldn't trust her. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, he trusted someone, but I, I, in some weird way, I remember playing it, playing it, thinking that Boyd is hoping, like, I hope you try something crazy because I'm just, I'm going to strangle you out in the woods here. <laughs> and that's a terrible thing to say. She's such a nice little girl, like, but like, oh, is she dangerous? Dangerous. <laughs> 
One thing that was driving me nuts, Harold, is yeah. that why don't you guys capture one of these night walkers? They only come out at night. So what would happen if you could capture one in the daytime? What would that do? You know, that that is just like, like get one of these things. It's an interesting call, but the question is, where are they in the daytime? Yes. That, like, and and because, and, and I don't know if you noticed it, maybe you have probably, as when, when they look like people, there's a milkman, they walk really slowly. <laughs> but when it turns, it goes so fast. Like, it just goes so fast. And it's like, like that turn is like, how do you capture something like that? Right. How do you, that's like, like, okay, I'm gonna go, oh, she's eating me, it's done, never mind, never mind. <laughs> yeah, since you open, the, you open the window and they, they change instantly. <laughs> yeah, there's not time yeah, like she's kissing, she's kissing the dude and changes in the midst. Like that's yeah. just, you don't have time to think. <laughs> right, seeing that hand turn into a claw, I'm like, oh my God, I'm freaking out, so. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. now, like I said, season finale is this Sunday, uh, I've seen yeah. it. And just on a personal level, uh, I'm so frustrated. <laughs> I'm just like, because if you want the definition of cliffhanger, just look up from yeah. in the dictionary, you know? <laughs> you know, yeah. so. Uh, the stuff with Jim, super scary. Yeah. The, yeah, it's really, I don't want to give a, I yeah, know There's too said. much to talk about, but if you're looking for answers, I'm saying seatbelts, you got to wait, you know? But still, <laughs> it, it gives you more questions. Not- Yes, 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 there's more exactly questions right. than answers, you know. So that means Perfect. I'm talking to you for season two next year. I know that. So, <laughs> yeah, uh, you and me, man, we clearly we're going to keep doing this. So let's yes. keep it going. <laughs> One of my favorite shows. It's a big hit. Congratulations, Harold. You're my favorite character. I said, thank you so much for talking to me today. It looks like this thing worked. So things were okay. It's, we're still here, brother. <laughs> <laughs> there's, someone here, my, brother. there's someone at my window. I got to go. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't tell it. Put the flowers away. Just if she gets up. Oh, God. I got to rub it. <laughs> Thanks so much. We'll talk again soon, all right? See you, my friend. All right, later.